Amelia from Lifehouse Kids. So happy to see you all. Let's have fun together. Okay, let's go. Matthew chapter 6 verse 33 What you should want the most is God's kingdom and doing what he wants you to do. Then he will give you all these other things you need. Let's pray for the message. God, say anything you want to me. I'm always here to listen to you. Amen. Hi everyone, this is Will. You know, one day, Abraham was tested by God to give something that was very precious to him. Do you have something that's precious to you? Maybe a family member, maybe a toy or a game? So let's find out exactly what Abraham was asked to sacrifice and give up. Abraham's Big Test God promised Abraham a son, and from that son, many descendants who would bless the whole world. But Abraham and his wife Sarah were too old to have children. Twenty years went by. Still, Abraham trusted God's promise. When he was 100 and Sarah was 90, God reminded them of his promise. Sarah was going to have a baby. When their son was born, Sarah was so joyful that she laughed. <laughs> God has brought me laughter, she said. So they named their son Isaac, which means he laughs. When Isaac was a boy, God tested Abraham by telling him to take Isaac to Mount Moriah and kill him as a sacrifice to God. 
Abraham was confused, but still he trusted God. Isaac carried the wood, and Abraham held the knife and torch. Together they climbed the mountain. Where is the lamb for the sacrifice? asked Isaac. God will provide it, Abraham replied. Abraham arranged the wood on an altar, tied up Isaac, and laid him on the wood. As he raised the knife to kill Isaac, an angel called his name. Abraham, don't hurt the boy, the angel cried. God knows you trust his promise. Look, there in the bushes, a ram is caught by its horns. Sacrifice that instead. So Abraham sacrificed the ram instead of his son. He called the place God will provide, because God provided the sacrifice. Just as God had said, his promise came true. So Abraham had his child when he was 100 years old, Isaac, his miracle child. But God asked him to sacrifice Isaac. And I bet you Abraham couldn't understand why God would ask him to do that. But you know what? Abraham knew that God loved him and Isaac very much. So you know what? He went ahead and went forward to get ready to sacrifice Isaac. But God offered a ram in Isaac's place because God was so impressed that Abraham was going to go and give his most precious thing up. And you know what? Because of that, God blessed Abraham, he blessed Isaac, and he gave Abraham many descendants just as he promised. So let's go ahead and give God our all today, whatever God wants. Let's be here for him and make him number one in our lives. So Lilia, what can we do to put God first in our daily lives? I want to make sure I spend time with God every single day. That's excellent. You know, putting God first in our lives by spending more time with Him, spending time with Him on a daily basis, or maybe it's time for you to sacrifice some TV time so that you can spend more time with God. But let's make God number one in our lives in everything that we do. So for today's craft, we're gonna make a sheep. Yay! All right, so in order to make your sheep, go ahead and get yourself some craft paper, like I have right here. Then go and get some cotton balls. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead and draw a picture of a sheep on to your paper. And you're gonna leave everything in, color everything on the sheep except the body part. And then you're gonna go ahead and take the cotton balls and glue them onto the sheep's body. And then, ta-da! Bah! You have your sheep. Good, that's pretty good. All right, it's time to go, so tell me everybody. We'll see you next time. Okay, thank you for coming. See y'all next time. Bye. Bye. See you next time. <laughs>「Hey guys, thanks for watching today!Did you guys have a good time today?LighthouseKids!Dewa, Hokani Mo Taksan no Moshiroi Doga Ga Ee Pai Aru Kara Zehi, LighthouseKids no YouTube Channel Ro Toruk Shite Ne!So we have a lot of fun kids contents just for you on this channel, so make sure you hit subscribe! そしてなんと LighthouseKids では毎週日曜日 Zoom でみんな集まって楽しいプログラムをしてるんだよ And every Sunday on Zoom, LighthouseKids get together and have amazing time together Zoom でオンラインでキッズリーダーたちと楽しい時間一緒に過ごさない And you get to interact with amazing kids leaders on Zoom So make sure you check that out too ぜひ参加したいってお友達は概要欄にあるリンクから申し込みしてみてね。And if you're interested in joining Zoom, make sure you check the link below in the description. みんなに会えるの楽しみにしてるよ。We're looking forward to seeing you. またね。Bye bye.